We put that in on the easy go. And guess what happened? Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. Well, we got that other part in. I did an ohm test on it with my new Snap-on ohm tester meter. Look at that thing. <gasps> I deserve one of them because I work on a lot of stuff. And, you know, I deserve to get one of those things. So I got one. And that's the way she is to it. But I put that in. And like I said, check this out. Oh! Something happened. So we're gonna just kind of tidy this thing up real quick here. Just kind of throw things together. And we're, and we're gonna take it out for a rip. And see what happens. That's what we do. We gotta make sure it's working. I think, I think we got her. I think we might have figured out the easy go. I think the easy go is it gonna go. What do you think though? Leave a comment down below. But we're gonna find out right now. I gotta move the Silverado too. Let's get the Silverado out of the way. Do you guys have any idea how happy I am right now? Like. Do you really even have a friggin' clue? Because I don't. Like, we're talking about some serious, how you doing? Because now I can make some cash on the old Easy Go. We'll get her all, hey, and guess what else? We can get some content on the old Easy Go too. Because we're gonna have to, some uh, fanciness to her. We're gonna make her fancy. It's even got reverse. I don't even know how that is possible. Oh my God. Captain. All right, she's on the ground. Now let's just have a nice little sit here. We gotta be careful. Oh, dick. Look at her go. What's really going on? She ain't going too fast, though, I'll tell you. <laughs> right now. Sounds like I'm friggin' dragging on something up here. Batteries are probably lower than dicks. What exactly is going on here? Maybe she's gonna just get moving. She probably hasn't moved in a long time. Oh my god, that is firing dicks. Take her back until the pair's up. I'm pretty sure we got uh, some dead battery action. Just saying. So I'm just gonna check the batteries real quick. So I'm probably thinking that we might just have a, a bad battery here. 12-2, 12-2, 10. So we have a bad battery. That's probably what's causing us to have a little bit of a not going nowhere feeling. So we're gonna have to do some charging, but hey, we got it moving and that's the biggest thing. So let's get some air in these tires and see if I can't drive it back into the garage instead of running around flat. Because if we have no power, that's definitely not gonna help the situation. And I think that's why it's beeping because it's saying, I haven't got no power, Captain. Let's put 20 in them. Give her some 20s. I'm sure the brakes are probably dragging. Not like we're working on a new card here. Careful, careful. I almost got 20. So there we go, I put a little bit more fuel, I put a little bit more fuel, put a little bit more power into her. Let's see if she moves any better. Which I doubt, because like I said, it's got a dead battery. But at least we'll drive her into the garage, maybe. We'll have to see. You see? It's not gonna make her. Oh yeah, it might make it. Aw, oh, dick. At least it's moving its own power now. Are you watching? Probably not. Well, we're definitely getting somewhere on the easy go. You just gotta get the battery situation figured out. Check the brakes, because I'm sure they're dragging. Actually, they're not bad. Uh oh, are we gonna get up this hill? <sighs> Decent. Aw, oh, dick. I don't know why it's doing that. Is it the motor doing that? Something vibrating, Jim. Yeah, I know you don't like it. I get it. Stop talking back. Oh, I need a screwdriver. I want to see how far that thing's going. We all know that this thing's been screwed with I don't know how many times. So I'm pretty sure somebody's probably screwed with that too. It doesn't like going backwards. Turn the key on. Put her in tow mode. Let's adjust this thing a little bit. All right, let's try her again. Take her to tow mode. Boop. Put the key on. Boop. Well, we're on to our next project. Figure it out. We'll charge the batteries up, make sure they're 100%. Make sure you put her in tow mode before you push these things. Remember, because that's how you take out the controllers. Hey. 
All right, so I'm gonna check for 36 volts. Checker again, negative, positive. 34 volts, so see, we haven't got enough power, and that's what's going on. But it's working, it's running, let's charge it up, and we'll go from there. So this is just a short little video on the easy go. I got caught up today. I put the ohm meter on that new part. Turns out it was a bad part, I was right after all. So we slapped the new part in, and we got movement. So we're going in the right direction. So hopefully on the next video, We'll be uh, fully charging these batteries up and trying her again. I've got three deep cycles in the garage. I might have to switch them out and try them in here because these batteries are older than decks. So join me next time on the Easy Go project and we'll get this thing going and we'll get right back into her and then we'll be able to fix her up. So I'm glad you're here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification. I love you all. And until the next one, you know what to do for now.